Hey guys, Popular Boat here, and I am playing some more Hearts of Iron 4 as the French Commune. Now, we're having some issues, or some pretty concerning issues with manpower, so I really need to start knocking out some of these wars. So Japan is going to be my next target, I just need to work out where to do my invasions from, and get them squashed. Um, what else is going on? We're pushing well into the Raj, we're fighting Greece at the moment, and Spain has secured their land. I want all of you guys to get the fuck over to here. Uh, where can we do a naval invasion from? Is it going to let us do one from here? Now we want a port. <laughs> yeah, I, I worry about it being confusing. I can't really... Um, all my YouTube videos, I just hit uh, stop and start on recording. So I always worry about... Um, I always worry that it will be misleading for people who are actually watching. Okay, let's do... No, I don't think we'll do a concentrated invasion. Or we'll do a concentrated invasion instead of spreading. And we'll go straight for Hiroshima. sounds good to me. Now, you guys are all assigned, and you're gonna walk across the fucking world to get there, aren't you? How about you don't do that? Although, that being said, it's gonna be the safest way for you to get there. Okay, we'll let you do that then. Go for a wander. Why aren't you guys pushing into here? How is the resistance looking now? Uh, F6. Yellow instead of red is good. <laughs> Might add a bit more cavalry. That's gonna cost so much though. Although it doesn't really increase the suppression amount as much as having... Hmm... Oh, that's what I should be doing. I should just be upgrading military police. Uh... Yeah... How are our dockyards looking? Still behind. It's not too awful. Tanks we're still very far behind on. Same for our anti-tank guns, same for motorized. I could probably reduce anti-tank guns in divisions now. Because um, we're really not facing that many tanks. Remove. That's going to free up 42,000 manpower. Excellent. Motorize has... Motorize, you don't have support. Don't really need it either. You guys don't need that. You guys could use artillery though. You have anti-tank tanks. What are we short on the most? Light tanks, we are very behind on, so let's knock some of them out. Light tank destroyers, medium tanks. Don't need as much there. Of 
cool. That sh that's freed up a bunch of manpower that we were otherwise just wasting. Let's get these bubbles closed. Close them bubbles. Where are we getting an invasion? Northwest Germany. Still can't actually see it. We do have radar coverage, so it's just being planned. Southeast Asia. I can't see Japan actually holding naval superiority to make that leap. Oh, it could be the UK even though. Let's jump back up to speed 3. Are we running low on submarines? Because I... Whoa, yeah. We've lost a lot of our submarines. Why are you in Southeast Asia? Oh, fuck's sake. <laughs> okay. There's the fucking problem. My submarines were set to have their home base in um, Indonesia. So when they need a repair, they're sending people across the fucking world. Uh, silly. Let's set that as Calais, and let's make sure these other ones are set properly. East China Sea, you're fine. You're still over there. Man, that's... Uh, that's painful. Uh, let's fix this line, because it's on the wrong side. Same for the purple line. Uh, I guess that's not so bad, though. It could be the full length, though. Where are you guys and what are you doing? Uh, you're heading over for your naval invasion. By the time they get there, this will probably have done the 70 days of planning required. Japan's pushing back into China again. Good job, China. We're getting into the Raj quite well, though. Encircle those US guys. Okay, we're pushing back there very well nicely. <laughs> we're about to squash 10 divisions of Australians. 37,000 people. Oh, I'm not liking how much Britain is pushing into in uh, Africa now, but at the same time I'm not that con concerned. How's our research looking? Okay, we're upgrading artillery and then I'm putting more into military police. Hey Greece, you ready to die yet? Hello Chris Miller, how you doing man? Soviets are pushing into Turkey quite nicely. Our manpower is dropping again. <laughs> How's the resistance looking now? Okay, that's looking way, way, way better in Germany. Cool, we've got better artillery. Let's get better military police. Ah, uh, that's why we just burnt a lot of manpower. We spat out a bunch more horses. Okay, I think we can safely grow that out again now. Maybe, maybe not. Uh, 
So you guys are on your way over to Japan. Let's put you in there. Can you guys finish that bubble off, please? Actually, you guys... You can go... Yes, I know. You can go garrison this Italian stuff. And I think these other guys can join them. Alright, so we've finished off North Africa. Let's get that line sorted back around. Oh shit, US has joined the Allies. We need to finish off the Axis now. Because that is going to be a, a lot of strength coming in. Damn it, Spain, hold your damn borders. <sighs> okay, Greece should be capitulating at this point. US has joined as our enemy. No surprises there. How have you not capitulated, Greece? Oh, you're like 90%, 98% of the way there. Okay, hopefully the US isn't going to be <laughs> a big, big issue. Oh, sorry, I hadn't realised I'd put, turned it back on. I usually play with it off when I'm streaming. I literally hadn't even noticed it was on. <laughs> I need to get this British Raj finished off. So I can move on. I'm getting closer to the capital. Let's see if we can get an encirculation going. Or oh, an encirclement. Greece has finally capitulated. Fantastic. Now we can send our tanks to more worthwhile places. I think Japan is going to be a good option for that, actually. Uh, any more ports along here? Now, I know um, tanks and motorized aren't going to be good for doing naval invasions, but once we land, we should be in a decent spot. Okay, let's crush this invasion. Uh, might as well have a full line. Switch the tanks over to Asia. <clears throat> oh, that's true. Thank you for pointing that out, because I had forgotten. Well, I had forgotten because I knew Soviets are pushing in on this side. Uh, can you guys stop moving and reassign to your line? Um, how are our constructions going? We've got a lot more factories back now. Resistance is shrinking. Good.
We almost have enough political power to increase our conscription laws. Are you going to show me the preview of where people are going? <clears throat> uh, what resources are we missing now? Good on everything except oil. Like, we're not getting as much out of all of these places, but we also don't... We have a ton of surplus of all this, so I can't afford to drop uh, resistance laws down. So our horses aren't so busy. So we've got extensive for 5% at the moment. We can go up to 10 and we lose factory output, construction speed, and training time. Which is pretty painful. And there's nothing quite in between. I think we'll save that for when we're actually desperate. Yeah, I do have some MP divisions. I have 42 of them. It's just a large area to cover, and um, I need to get the next level of Military Police 2, which I am working on. I also just need to finish off this Axis War. It's the biggest, biggest thing that's going to help, because then I'll actually own those lands and they won't be resisting. You guys get pushing. We have plenty of anti tanks now. Not too far behind on a lot of stuff anymore. Fighters and stuff we still need lots of. Tanks we still need a fair few of. We should push light tanks up. Artillery we don't need heaps. Anti tank we're filled. So anti tank can go down. Yeah, I'm not too concerned. It's just more area for them to be spread more thinly. I don't think Greece had a whole ton of factories anyway. I probably need to check my laws again. slowly draining. Okay, we're gonna have to jump manpower up and then I can just spit out more military police. And we've got enough factories that we can produce enough shit to keep up. Recruitment. Deploy. That's gonna help a fair bit with that. Can you just squash what's left there please? And there goes a bunch more divisions. Okay, our people are slowly arriving, ready for the invasion of Japan. 
That's good. You guys need to close that bubble. I can actually push that line back again now. Can you attack up the river rather than across it? Closer though to capitulating. About halfway. Okay. Uh, do we have people who aren't that busy over here? Spare planes. We do actually. Oh no, that's. Um, spare planes for carriers. I don't know if we even have any carriers. No. Uh, This is a bit of a mess. I don't know if these guys are merging back up or not. So I'm gonna get all of my... Get my naval forces all back up here and recombine them. Well, for my submarines at least. Uh, what's happening now? Yeah, that's not gonna happen. East Canada? Why do I care about East Canada? Oh, I have this! I didn't know I had that. Oh, I don't really care if they navally invade, invade that. Middle East has low supply. That's to be expected with that many people there. Can you guys catch him, please? Okay, we may need to start training up some new divisions again. Let's get these training. Five, six. Assign you to brown. And I will switch these back to being regulars. Okay, we are just about ready to invade Japan. You guys need a new line. Let's get rid of your. Uh, well, let's draw a, current, a new one and then get rid of that one. fighting the American Navy. That is annoying. Okay, time to cross into Japan once that battle is over. And... Yeah. We really are going to have to focus more on Navy again. Mm. 
the US is losing a lot though. Yeah, look at that. 24 submarines, a plane. We're shredding the shit out of them. Okay, let's get these going. Launch, launch. And while we do that, let's take off... Oh, you're a small fleet. You guys both don't have many ships. Ah, oh, you've got detached units. Uh, you guys need to get out of that combat and head into port. Ah, oh, you guys are still on your way over. Alright. Okay, let's see how these invasions go. Hopefully we'll land alright. Probably not. How much do they have there? Six divisions. Yeah, they got a ton of people there. That's alright. If we don't land, we'll just try again. Why aren't you guys moving yet? Oh, you're not finished preparing. Okay, that got beaten back. Let's set up a new one. Why... Why are you no longer assigned? Okay, new plan. Go land there. Nope. There, there, and there. Yeah, do that, and then we'll hopefully be able to get a, a proper landing from that. Let's see if our tanks have better luck. Probably won't, but... Gotta try. The Soviets are pouring into Africa. So are the Americans. you guys not fuck my supply? Why the hell? <laughs> There's so many, so many AI stacks here. It's just crazy. Okay, we've got major, uh, improved maintenance company. Uh, land doctrine we're still working on. Tanks I don't care about increasing. We should probably jump up to weapons 3. Has our navy arrived? No, not yet. You guys need to get the fuck out of there. Well, I need to merge my fleets back up, because the, the game separated them. I wish we had a way to be able to um, merge fleets ourselves. Can you guys get out of there, please? Thank you. Okay, how is our resistance looking now? Significantly better. Good. I think I will reduce the German next. Ah, uh, not German. I've already reduced German. Italian. 
And we'll put that back onto harshest. To get the factories. Merge fleets, what? Well, you have the option of um, setting your fleets to automatically split off, and sometimes that breaks. Oh no, they are still attached. That's good. I've had situations where the split off fleet isn't attached anymore, and I've had to manually put them back together so they're under the same. They have to not be assigned to a job. Like, if I have people patrolling, I can't just add more fleets back to it. Or add a fleet back to it again. Oh, fuck's sake. Stupid buttons moving. Uh, I want you attached to that. Yeah, I'm looking forward to the next couple patches to get everything fixed up. Um, I was going to have a look at how many people are actually in this division. Five. I'll drop that down once we get the next lot arriving. Good, we've got better tech. Uh, I want to go for better decryption. Get those bonuses. We are almost landing in Japan. That can still flip around in our favor as more people arrive. Yep, our tanks are almost landing. Naval combat, naval combat, air superiority, Southeast Asia. Yeah, no one's actually landing there, buddy. Are you... You guys are all just busy repairing. That naval invasion is never going to happen. I do not like having to fight US and American Navy. Construction 4 is done. Excellent. It is close enough to 93 that we can get faster um, faster production efficiency growth. Still low on fighters. Could use some more light tanks. Other than that, we're looking really good for equipment. Medium tanks are filled. Fighters we need a ton of. I think I might actually prioritize more bombers. Oh no, infantry equipment. Yeah, we still got a lot of upgrading to do on that. What resources are we short on? A little bit of oil. Not fussed about the rest. And I need to put a break in here. So, thank you guys for watching. I hope you've been enjoying. Like, subscribe, check out links below, and I'll see you in the next episode.